Hello, everyone. My name is Rick Lyon. I believe this country is headed down two paths, and neither is good. The path to socialism, where the government controls everything and everybody, or the path to revolution, where we, the people, get fed up with tyranny and our freedoms are taken back by force. I sincerely believe that Convention of States and Article 5 of the Constitution are the only peaceful, legal, and legitimate way to prevent either of these two outcomes. We once talked about saving freedom and, Repu and the Republic for our grandchildren and future generations, but those days are gone. Now we must save it for ourselves. It is our generation's turn to answer the call of freedom. And we may not be fighting on the beaches of Normandy, but our battles are no less important. By not using our right to self-govern, by not participating in government, by the people, by trusting our future to career politicians and trusting the media to keep an eye on things. The wolf of socialism has found its way into our homes and now we are cornered and our liberty is wounded. Most of us would go quietly to our fate lamenting, but what can I do? However, many Americans won't. With socialism, the government is God. Obedience is the religion. China is murdering Uyghurs for their beliefs. They are putting Muslims in prison camps and ironically the Taliban just sold its soul to the Chinese Communist Party. Don't believe that that can't happen here. Christians are persecuted here in this country where freedom of speech and freedom of religion are the bedrocks of our government. I believe that what we are experiencing today is actually a war on religion and I am here with Convention of States to help stop that. America was created because of our desire for religious liberty, freedom to choose to worship as we believe, not the way some king requires us to believe. Religion in all its various flavors is fundamental to civilization because it gives value to every human life as a child of God. An ideal social order is that in which every man loves his neighbor as he loves himself. And when we value ourselves and each other, we're nicer to each other. And we become moral, law-abiding, tax-paying citizens who foster peace on earth, goodwill and prosperity for all. And no government of any kind can mandate that. But today our own government is waging a war on the very thing that put them in power, our faith in God, love of country and loyalty to family. The media demeans these values and our religious institutions fail to stand up for them. We need new leaders, spiritual men and women who are devoted to the spiritual regeneration of mankind, who will supply the leadership and inspiration necessary for the social, moral, economic and political uplifting of this world. All that is required for evil to succeed is that good people do nothing. I believe that only through convention of states that we, an army of grassroots citizen activists working legally and peacefully through Article 5 of the Constitution can reclaim our right to government by the people and our right to worship as we choose, when we choose, and where we choose. Our founding fathers with Article 5 gave us the power to rein in our runaway government. But the thing about freedom is this use it or lose it. And that is the lion truth. Thank you.